The data center sector is growing at an extraordinary pace, estimated at around a 15% compound annual growth rate. 10 gigawatts is projected to break ground globally in 2025, with an additional 7 gigawatts likely to reach completion. As a result of this, we estimate that $170 billion in data center development will need to secure either construction loans or permanent financing in 2025. Permanent financing for data centers is typically structured at a 65 to 75 percent loan to value. Historically, data centers have been financed by a small group of infrastructure and real estate banks. But within the last year, we have seen a greater diversity of banks as well as private debt funds. Most of these loans have been commingled with insurance capital, allowing them to price more competitively. The average data center investment sale is more than $100 billion, so the buyer pool is almost exclusively institutional grade. Additionally, this is a highly specialized asset class which presents operational risks and barriers to entry for potential buyers. For investors who are newer to the sector, we have seen many active in land development, which presents an opportunity for quicker returns of capital with less risk. Conversations about data center obsolescence are common, particularly from investors who are new to the sector. All we need to do is look at some of the largest data center operators who have facilities that are approaching 20 years old and achieving record rents. And it is important to remember that data centers are constantly evolving and being upgraded. This is particularly true for co-location facilities, which are designed in a modular fashion and adapt over time to meet tenant needs.